I'm with Mohammed Al Haj, Chairman of GulfSat. Mohammed, congratulations! I hear you re recently uh, received a broadcast license. Uh, could you share more details with us? Yeah. Uh, well, uh, finally today we have a, a license from the Ministry of Communication, Ministry of Information, wait for the broadcast and rebroadcast uh, for the TV uplink business. Uh, Gulfsat is a company just in the market for the last 18 years, but we've been dealing with uh, most of the telecommunication under the VSAT license. And today we became uh, uh, one of the major uplinkers for the TV as well as for the VSAT business. And you're saying that this uh, broadcast license is not easily available? You're yeah. one of the few. Yeah, I agree because, uh, you know, with the changes of the regulations on the contents and the media side and the convergence between the media and the telecom, those kind of licensing is mixed between the Minister of Information and Minister of Communication, but finally I believe we can end up with a, a scenario of releasing such license to us from the government. Right. Um, you're also launching a new uh, satellite on October 1? As a matter of fact, the satellite will be launched through UTILSAT. Uh, yeah. And uh, through our global agreement with UTILSAT, uh, we have uh, multiple transponders. Uh, reserved to us uh, for, for the long term, basically the life cycle of the satellite. Uh, this is called uh, EAWC, uh, basically 7.8 degree. Uh, that's the gap filler. Transponder will be launched first of October. As well as there will be available capacity on AB7, uh, uh, which is a very popular uh, area of, of coverage. Uh, it will be on a 7 degree. Uh, that will be available on 1st of October as well. Right. Uh, anything else you can share with us, perhaps exclusively? Well, uh, GulfSat, uh, the most important thing is the engine behind. Uh, and I believe GulfSat has a unique engine in terms of uh, a converged platform, in terms of uh, uh, carrying an IP uh, uh, of a voice, data and video. GulfSat established multiple nodes, around nine nodes. We just recently had two nodes from Jordan. Cyprus, uh, basically to serve the clients and to carry the IP contribution and the contents from anywhere to anywhere over the globe. Right. And how has IBC been for you? Well, IBC, I believe, is a major and a very important show to GulfSat. Uh, uh, I believe uh, most of the you know partners and customers, clients, we meet every year here in, in, in IBC. And I think it's a great opportunity for everyone. Excellent. Thank you, Mohammed. Thank you.